Yo, what's going on guys? Bobby here and today we're back with another video. So yesterday was a crazy grind. I know I haven't been putting out videos that much as of late. We missed three days in a row, so I am totally sorry for you guys, but we were very, very busy. So while we were gone, we got a rank 35 Frank, which we're going to be showing you guys some gameplay of today, as well as we got rank 35 Rico. We love Rico, but unfortunately we couldn't get a Rico video out for you guys. So we will get one soon because I know exactly how much you guys like Rico. But with that being said, we have quals next or not quals, sorry, monthly finals next weekend, which is super, super, super important. And as well as the fact is we wanted to get these rank 35s out of the way before season reset as it also reset a few hours ago. You guys can see it is dark right now as it is like 6 in the morning right now. Um, and we're recording this before we go to sleep for you guys so you guys don't have to wait another day. But with that being said, we're just going to hop into some games. We're going to show you guys some Frank gameplay. So let's hop into it and let's show you guys what's up. All right, so here we go into the first game over here. Now, we were playing with Safari and Sky, so huge shoutouts to them. Now, I know it is a little bit zoomed in right now, but it was the only way we were able to get the video properly. So I, I do apologize for that. But anyways, we're just going to be following around my Frank for the entirety of the game. So with Frank, you definitely want to play on a map with a lot of walls so that you can get close to your opponents. If it's an open map, you're likely going to face units such as Piper or Brock or Cole, and you're just going to get absolutely torn down. Now, with Frank, you know, there's not a ton that you can do. You're quite limited with the stuff that you can do. You basically just walk up and try and kill your opponents. But obviously, super is the best way to do so. You want to be able to get your super and just kill as many people as possible with it. Always trying to hit your super is something that is very important. I would highly recommend being very conservative with your super and making sure you don't waste your super with Frank unless you basically 100% know you're going to hit it. It is also the way you score goals. It's the way you bait people. It gets people afraid of you. Your super is basically everything. Now with your gadget, your gadget is very simple. You kind of, you just want to use it when you're going to use your super so that you don't waste your super if like a BB hits you or a Primo jumps on you or a Shelly supers you or anything like that. You guys just want to block off any of that stun. But again, you're just going to use your 10k HP and your super to just try and absolutely just destroy people. We're going to be giving the ball over here. We have an open net. We're going to score that one. It's going to be the end of the first game. So let's hop into the next game and let's keep going. So here we go into the next game. Now, this game was a little bit rough. Now, you guys do know as Frank, you have counters that you counter really, really well, such as like a Rosa or a Jackie or something like that. Even a Poco, something that just can't kill you, that doesn't have enough damage to kill you. But you also get countered pretty hard. And you guys can see we're facing Surge, who obviously is a good Frank counter because you just stay distance. You know, Frank kind of feeds the Surge. Um, and then we're facing Sprout and Barley on a map with a lot of walls. So although we do love having a lot of walls being a Frank, we do not love facing this. As this is going to be an extremely tough one. So what you want to do against this is basically just walk up. And I mean, you're feeding, but you're not really feeding. You want to just get your super. We're able to hit two shots off the start of the game right there, those two. And we're only one shot away from getting our super. So it's already pretty decent, although they have us in our spawn. They can't really, you know, just take down the ball and destroy us. We're able to get one shot over there that does give us our super. So this is kind of opening up the leeway for us to score. Against a really good team with this comp, there's no way we would have been able to do something. But we were able to back up the barley by hitting it once. This guy's able to get a kill over there. And after an entire minute, we're now able to actually move up to our to their side of the map and actually try to do something. Now, they do have a level 4 surge. Which of you guys have been playing Brawl Stars any time in the last two weeks? You guys know exactly what a level 4 surge means. I think Sky is going to be able to kill it over here. He is going to be able to. I'm going to pass the ball to Saf over there. Now, the Sprout is going to block the wall, but it's going to be fine. As you know, we're just kind of chilling. Saf is level 3. Their, uh, their Sprout's only level 1. And now we have them pinned back. And they do not do a lot of damage. They can't really back us up. So when I come into the picture, I'm just going to have too much health for them to actually be able to do anything. I'm going to go up to this wall over here. I'm going to try and break this wall or move up and try and break another wall to try and get our goal. So I'm going to grab the ball over here, shoot it off the wall, use that super, be able to get the kill and the stun. I'm going to throw the ball off the wall over there because they're all dead except for one. And I'm able to get my super back if I hit one more shot. So that's exactly what we're going to do. And we're able to move up. So again, we kind of just tanked some shots, was able to get our super. And we were able to score a goal in that manner and get out of our spawn. And then right there, you have 10k HP. You can walk up, tank a few shots. You're going to be able to, to score. So again, let's hop into the next game. All right, so here we go into our next game. Now, this game, we're going to be going up against Rico, Dinah, and Surge. Now, this is surprisingly a good combo on this map. This is one of Dinah's best maps in the game. And a good Dinah can actually destroy here. And then we're facing Surge. I don't have to speak about Surge. You guys already know how OP Surge is. And Rico. And this is also one of Rico's best maps in the game. So it's actually a pretty diverse comp for brawlers that usually aren't as good. So you guys can see pretty strong start for us. We're able to grab the ball and move up in mid. Now, unfortunately, their Dinah is kind of backing Sky up. I tried to hit a little dribble play over there because I knew I was going to die. 
uh, or not die. Sorry. I knew I was going to get gadgeted or not gadgeted super. Sorry. Again, it's six in the morning. So I am forgetting a few things here. Um, and I tried to dribble while getting supered. Unfortunately, it didn't work over there. Um, so the mic's going to have the ball. I'm just going to try and push up on it. Unfortunately, though, what I'm basically doing instead of pushing up is feeding their surge. So their surge is able to upgrade to level two while ours is only level one. I was able to get one hit, but it wasn't really worth it. Worth it. If you're playing a Frank, do not get close to that surge or surge will absolutely destroy you. It's not even going to be close. So again, I'm just standing here. I'm kind of feeding the surge. Rico does counter me. I do pretty well against the Dynamite, except the only issue with Dynamite is he stays behind walls. So there really isn't anything I can do here. A minute into the game and I'm finally able to get my super. So things are going a little bit better right now. As you guys can see, I'm trying to just chill in this mid. Try and just kind of juke back and forth. Let Sky and Saf try and do something. But unfortunately, they have us backed up pretty well. They're doing a good job. Saf's able to get one kill over there. I have my super, so I'm going to walk up. Sky's able to get a kill, but now they have level four surge. And so we're going to move up. We're going to try and make a play over here. We're able to get the surge. I'm going to put the ball in the net. And thank God that we were able to get that kill because the level four surge is just not okay, as you guys know. So we're able to get that stun and that goal. So all we need to do now, right, basically, is just defend for, I believe, 45 more seconds. I'm going to go down over here because the dynamite did clutch up for that Rico. Saf's doing a pretty good job. He's going to use his gadget, but unfortunately, he is going to die. So 40 seconds left. Sky's able to get a kill. He played that really well. Sky read that. As he said, quote, unquote, in group chat later, Sky said, I read that like a book. And he did. He was able to stop that really well. Unfortunately, the Rico is able to stop my goal over there. And, you know, things are going all right. 25 seconds left in the game. Um, the ball is just in the corner for them right now. I'm going to go down. Sky is the ball. He's just trying to stay alive. He's going to push it up, try and sneak in a goal. But the Brock's going to be able to get that save. Or not Brock, sorry. Dinah. Again, 6 in the morning. I'm very tired. But I'm just going to super our goal as this is basically the end of the game. There's nothing that they can really do right now. And that is going to be it. This is a very stressful game as they were pretty good. But we're able to get the dub. So let's move on and let's keep going. So here we go into the next game. And we're going up against BB, Dinah, and Surge. So again, a pretty good comp. But Frank does counter BB because of the gadget. So it should go pretty well. So I'm going to waste the gadget over there just because I thought a BB was going to try and hit me. He's not going to or she's not going to go for it. But we are going to be able to get our super. So that's actually a pretty good start. Even though we did die, getting a super 15 seconds into a game with the Frank is actually really, really good. Especially if your teammates can hold it down, which I know Sky and uh, and Saf will be able to do. So we're kind of just chilling over here. I don't want to waste my super because I don't know if the BB is going to be in there or not. Or Well, I do know it's going to be in there, but I don't know exactly where. I'm going to be able to take out their surge, which is obviously important. Saf with a really nice gadget over there to stay alive. That was really, really good. And now I have my super, so this is looking pretty easy. Just going to use my super. Going to be able to get a kill and one stun over there. Going to get my super back, and I'm just going to put the ball in the net. Make the score one to nothing, only 45 seconds into the game. And I do have my super again, so that's really good. As you guys can see, the surge is using its gadget, their surge, to stay to just go through walls for no reason. I definitely wouldn't recommend doing that as it's basically useless. Um, very big waste of your gadget. You should be using your gadget to try and get a kill, try and get your super, or try and stay alive. Not just to uselessly or wastefully just do something. But anyways, uh, I'm going to miss a shot over there. Sky is the ball right now. He's trying to be a sneaky Sky person right now. Um, he's going to go for a trick shot. Unfortunately, it's going to be stopped. I'm going to be hit by that uh, mic super. I'm going to be able to kill the mic though. And Saf is just going to gently put that ball in the net. And that is going to be it for this game. So unfortunately, as you guys can see in the replays, the last game was only 33 seconds uh, for the 1246 game because one of the teammates went AFK. And then the 2 minute and 11 second game, which was actually our rank 35 game, the replay is not available. So anyways, that's going to be it for today's video. If you guys did enjoy this rank 35 gameplay, make sure to leave a like. Let me know in the comment section below. And if not, let me know as well. Um, but that's going to be it. I'm going to get you guys some Rico gameplay soon. I'm sorry for the big break, but I have been preparing for the finals and doing these rank 35s. So we are going to be back on a daily schedule soon. But anyways, that's going to be it. I will see you guys again tomorrow. Peace.